Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Leka here. I'm super, super excited because I'm about to watch Nigerian Sun by Lachu Iren. I'm super excited. I've been, you know, I've seen the trailer. I'm super, um, I'm just, I'm just looking forward to seeing the, the um, short film. So I'm just going to be showing you guys as I watch it and um, my reactions and all that. I must see your face. Gang, gang. They are going to throw people down. If you've got it to this part of this um, video, please make sure you also subscribe to my channel. Please don't skip this part without subscribing, okay? Subscribe, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. Don't judge me if you never walk out for my show. I told you, they are not bad guys. No one is innocent but either. they're going to hospitalize you like flashback. It's just that there's too much at stake. It's not like we don't want to be patient. We just have so much to lose. We want to be our wow. brother's keeper, but but the system. It's the system. Man, nobody send you. Every man for wow. himself. Every get how you it get just it. Ah, the hospital. They're going to realize it's the same police, you know. Your memory okay. is. There are some days you never forget. <laughs> this guy's like a good actor. I met this one. <laughs> she is a good actor. Serious wala for who no expect bouncing baby yeah. boy. Oh wala for who no get fine wife. It's fine too actually. Ah, I'm not. Wala for who no get to take care of your family. Yeah. They say every story has two sides. It's a machi. This life. The life no balance. They say every story must have good guy and bad guy, a hero and wow. a villain. Man, it's not that simple, Joe. We are all just ordinary people. Yeah. It takes the depth of relationship with God to be able to write something like this. I know you like it. I'm your plug. And that's why when I say I am your plug. Wait, wait. It be this. It be serious this. Okay, good for you. You scratch my back. Wow. I scratch your back. And we they forget, say, we just they leave the front exposed. And I don't want the pain pass. For me, the, I just like the fact that the message is very, very... Um, it, 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 it hits deep. And I like the fact that it looks effortless, but they are there's like a very very powerful message because usually if there was like gunshots and blah blah blah, you know, talking here and there, there seems to be more action. But for me, there's a lot more action in the fact that you can't necessarily hear them, but you can feel the story. You can feel what is happening. It's saying a lot about you know our government, the state of living here in Nigeria, and all that. Like when these people are being brutal, they don't even think about the effect that there's so many families like that that they till today they don't know how they they are there's so many families that they today they don't know how you know their their loved ones died. So really, the government needs to reform the police. The police do whatever they want because there's nobody checking them. Do you grab? I really feel like films can travel. That's a good thing. Films travel. Stories travel beyond the writer you know stories are something you can use to you can use to um reach out to people without ever talking to them so um but yeah i enjoyed this movie and if i was to rate it can i if i was to rate it i'll give it like 11 if i was to rate it i can i wish i can give it like 100 over 10 
it was really really good i enjoyed every bit of it this um, this was really really interesting and it's something that gets you thinking and like i said it looks so easy but so complex you know it looks like they didn't do much but they did a lot um i really everybody's acting was great because you know what would have happened all these parts that you can't hear the sound they probably said it they probably acted everything and they just took off the sound which is very very creative thumbs up like even you did amazing as usual as usual she did amazing oh my god we tap grace as writers <laughs> we tap grace to write stories no i said we tap grace as writers or to write you know deep stories like this deep deep well written stories you know she did an amazing job she's a very very talented writer she's gifted and skilled very gifted and skilled and i'm happy that i i got to see it you know at this time yeah i enjoyed it quality was amazing uh if i is such a good actor this guy's like a good actor I this one <laughs> <laughs> oh, a good serious wala for who know they expect bouncing baby yeah. boy. Oh wala for who know get fine wife. It's boy. fine too actually. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Ah, wala for who know take care of your family. Yeah. They say every story has two sides. It's a mashi. This life, the life not balanced. I was just saying that we shouldn't um, keep quiet about it because. Whatever affects souls touches the heart of God, you know. If people are dying and even whether they are born again or not born again, because the truth is that everybody, God created everybody and He wants the people to have a chance to have a relationship with Him at least. Because if people are dying even before their before their time, where would they even give their lives to Christ? People's destinies and lives and their eternity is also cut short. So we as Christians need to play our part, you know, whatever it is God has giving us to do let us do it well whatever sort of influence you're called to to impact let us do it with all our hearts also a message to me like really we can't be silent we can't be silent or doing everything we do we should be led and guided by the holy spirit let's be guided let's be let's do it in wisdom like if you are creative this is in fact i feel like creatives have a very big message you know because you can put the message in in different forms in art in music you know you're passing the message people are hearing it while there are some of us that would take more maybe in politics you know influence our our, our um, circle and influence those around us through politics decision making leadership we need we're in, we're in a serious need of you know leaders good leaders leaders that have integrity yeah so so it's a good watch and like i said i rate it 100 over 10. <laughs> 100 over 10 it was really really good i'm thinking of what else to say it was a good story well written well executed well acted well interpreted everything was just on point you know i like seeing christian faith-based you know message field if there's anything if that's correct i like seeing rich and the story was a rich story like i didn't even mention that very rich rich and you know story that has balance balanced diet story <laughs> all right so guys in this video first that saying <laughs> other things anyway yeah i enjoyed it 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 but if you'd like to see um more videos like this please let me know in the comments i tried to do it like a more vloggy kind of video before i was thinking of i was gonna you know sit in front of the camera and see what i liked about the movie and all but i thought mm, for a change Come and chill with me, you know? Yeah. Anyway, I'll see you guys in my next video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I'd love to know if you've seen Nigerian Sun. What are your thoughts? I'd love to know that in the comments as well. Thank you so so much for watching. The Lord bless you and keep you because it's faith general you. <laughs> anyway, bye bye guys. I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Is the Mikey on the beat?